Llorente has put Son away down the left and herring forward is Sissoko and Sissoko is in the penalty area and he's rolled it in! Bruce Sissoko gives Tottenham the lead after just five minutes and after the best moment for West Ham at one end of the pitch, Llorente's flick sent Kenwin Son away down the left, he rolled it in field and Moussa Sissoko who's had a bit of a troubled time at Tottenham since his arrival from Newcastle, nets in a London derby, Tottenham one, West Ham nil. This is played short to Danny Rose on the corner of the penalty area. Back to Trippier, who now floats his cross far post. Ali's had a brilliant save by Adri Ali at his near post. Deli Ali stole in at the back. No one picked him up, and it really was a free header, and it's a fine reaction stop. Ali with one step over, then another drifts past him, rolls it square. Son just outside the D, onto his left foot. Ali inside the penalty area, tries to place it. Oh, it's gone in! Tottenham have scored a second goal, and they did pick their way through West Ham in the end, Spurs, and it dropped to Deli Alley, who just managed to sneak it into the corner. It may well have taken a deflection, which foxed Adrian, but with nine minutes to go in this first half, Tottenham Hotspur in complete control of this Carabao Cup fourth round tight. Cresswell down the left. Here's Carroll. Shoulder to shoulder here with uh, Juan Foyth, tries to take him on on that side, takes it to the corner flag and Foyth's foot in, takes it out for a corner. This corner's headed away as far as Fernandez who drives it, great save, and the follow-up by Ayu goes in, in front of the West Ham fans, they pull one back at Wembley, ten minutes into the second half, the first shot by Fernandez went through a forest of legs, and Form got down to his left to push it away, Ayu reacts into the net, Tottenham 2, West Ham 1. Yeah, maybe there is a way back in for West Ham, excellent strike when the ball was cleared from Fernandez, as you say, through the ruck of bodies. Here is the goal scorer, IU, turns and runs at Dyer, given to Lanzini. This is much better from West Ham. Cresswell down the left. His cross is going to look for IU or Carroll, headed away uh, by Alder Virel, only as far as Ogbonna, who nods into the mix. And it'll drop to Lanzini, who's onside. Yep. IU steers it in 2 2. West Ham have scored twice in the space of four minutes. Andre IU's got another one. And those West Ham fans have gone absolutely crazy behind that goal. Where has this recovery come from Slavan Bilic punches the air and this London derby's all square Tottenham 2 West Ham 2 remarkable transformation can he bottle that to half time team talk because he certainly found some words of wisdom as the Croatian and he's got a response and Andre Ayew from Carroll's death flick off Lanzini's brilliant outside of the right foot cutback has scored a brace, 2-2, two, two. staggering turnaround. Trippier, wide to Sissoko, clips it into the box, Lorente chases it, Ali shoots, great save by Adrian, on the volley. He's kicked through there, Deli Ali, actually, he might have got caught on the instep. It was a spectacular effort, fine goalkeeping. Are you on that right side? And he switches it to the left and Aaron Cresswell. Cresswell winds up a left-footed cross and in behind by Foyth. Corner ball. This is floated yep. in. Flicked into the net! And they've scored again on Bonner. Got his head to it in front of all of the Tottenham defenders. And it's flashed past form and it's 3-2. The Hammers were dead and buried at half time, but they've come up with three goals in the space of a quarter of an hour. And Angelo Ogbonna has headed the Hammers into the lead for the first time. Tottenham 2, West Ham 3 at Wembley. Brilliant. Super header. Just sort of eased the ball in with a bit of curl. Perfect height, wasn't it, from Lanzini? And he just aggressively run and jumps and used his height, Ogbonna. He used the pace of the delivery. It glanced off his forehead and it went and drifted beyond Vorm into the top left-hand corner.
An outstanding turnaround here. We've, we've done some London derbies, Nick, haven't we, over the years, my friend? But this, this is something else, this one. Son into the box for Tottenham. Offloads now to Sissoko. Oh, it's saved by Adrian. That's it. And West Ham have won. They have beaten Tottenham Hotspur by three goals to two at Wembley in one of the more remarkable cut ties you will see this season. It did not look on at half time when Tottenham took a very robust 2 0 lead, but a flurry of goals at the start of the second half. Two from Andre Ayew and one from Angelo Ogbonna has snatched a place in the quarter finals away from Tottenham and sent it back round the North Circular, jingling away in West Ham United's back pocket. The goal to Spurs in the first half from Sissoko which put them on their way and Ali's shot was deflected to make it 2 at the interval West Ham looked dead and buried but from somewhere for the sake perhaps of their fans perhaps of their manager who knows they came back from the dead and won it through goals from Andre Ayew twice and Angelo Ogbonna headed in the corner it's as simple as that Tottenham are out and West Ham are through Spurs